Hey Maximizers, welcome back to my channel. We are here at Walgreens and I left my microphone at home so I hope you guys can hear me. So we're gonna go see if we can snag the Gillette deal, okay? So let's see what we can find. Okay, so here's the Gillette deal. When you buy two, you get 5,000 points. They're $1.99 each, so it's gonna be $3.98 or you're gonna get back 5,000 points. So it's gonna be a dollar and some change money maker. It's when you buy, so you can roll points. So I'm gonna use 4,000 points to get back 5,000 points. So again, it's a $1 money maker. My store has six, so I grabbed six. Well, there's seven, there's one left on the shelf. I left one for someone else. Um, so it's actually tagged, so I'm excited. And then uh, these ones are on sale too. Not as good of a deal as the other one, but still a good deal. But I am getting these, and again, I cleared the shelf. So yeah. I usually don't do that, but this is a good deal, and I could always use shaving cream or give it away. Okay, so I'm not at my usual Walgreens, but this place is covered. Look at the cover girl. This store is covered in clearance, so there wasn't really too much over here where I was like, mm, let me get it. The coupons with it wasn't too good, but let me show you this all May. First off, this uh, BB cream, $3.69 from $14.49. And we have this $3 off on May face coupon that came out in one of our smart sources yesterday on January 6th. So luckily they had the shade that I would go for, the 500. I grabbed the last one, so it's in my hand. $3.69, so it's gonna make it just 69 cents and it'll count towards Walgreens Beauty Club. I wanted to grab a dark, dark shade, but it's still $7. So I'm like, yeah, maybe I'll come back next week to see if it goes cheaper. And then up here, look at this, the dark, dark shades four dollars and 29 cents so for a full foundation a dollar 29 i'm like super super tempted to go ahead and buy one because i have a three dollar off coupon so it literally would make it a dollar 29 cents like i'm so tempted but i may wait i may wait till next week because there's like three in there it's probably still gonna be here and this is not i don't necessarily need it need it but i'm definitely getting the 69 cents bb cream for sure okay so make sure you are checking your clearance and looking at your prices okay super frustrated with walgreens i did a different candy different size and i'm still not getting a register reward okay so i've tried every single candy the trolley the black forest none of them will print for me so i'm not doing the deal at all because the register reward would not print I've got gift cards now because it wouldn't work, so they had to give me my points back on a gift card. And this, I've never had this problem at Walgreens, never. Okay, Maximizers, I'm at another Walgreens. So this is like Walgreens number three or my third trip this week at Walgreens, whatever. I'm putting it all together in a video. Um, and I tried to do the candy deal and thankfully it went through. Um, so I was able to do it twice. Now it went through, but it didn't go through on my main phone number. So I used my old phone number that I don't use anymore. So I didn't really have any points that I could use. I think I had like 2000 points to roll from that old phone number because for whatever reason, my main phone number was not working for whatever reason, could not get it to work to save my life. So I was able to use my older phone number, but of course I don't have a lot of points there. So I was able to get two things of candy and I did the toilet paper deal again. So once I get back home, I will go through all the transactions and tell you how everything went, okay? Okay, Maximizers, I'm back home from Walgreens. I did go to two stores, um, just to clarify. And I was on the hunt to do the Black Forest gummy deal. They are $1.99 on sale. And when you buy one, you're supposed to get a $1.99 register reward. When I went on Sunday, I did not get my register reward. They ended up giving me 2,000 points. So that's the one I showed you guys in my Sunday haul. I went back to Walgreens on Monday to try again. I did three transactions trying to get gummies and I showed you guys what in store my frustration. And every single time it didn't work, I was at a different store so the uh, manager just refunded me onto a gift card. Um, I did it three times, it didn't work any of the time so he refunded me and I used the gift cards. So finally I gave up. Today is Thursday, I went back to my main Walgreens and I decided to use my old phone number which I still use from time to time but not frequently at all. I used it and I actually got a pack of the Black Force gummies. So I did one, I paid two fourteen dollars out of pocket just to see if the register reward would print. And if it didn't, you know, I would ask for 2,000 points back or I would have um, just asked for a refund. It went through and I got my $1.99 register reward, okay? And I didn't film this in store because 
I was like, if it doesn't work, I don't want to be frustrated again. But it worked, so I was excited. I got one back. So then I was like, I want to go ahead and do the toilet paper deal again. But I want to make sure that the register reward still works. So I went ahead and I used my um, old phone number again in order to do transaction number two. Which in transaction number two, I got a Black Forest Gummies and I got a Scott Comfort Plus. The register reward did print. So now I have two of them. And my old phone number had 2,000 points on it. So, just to go through, I'm going through backwards because I did do these ones first. But let's go backwards because I didn't film this, these. Um, so, for that first transaction, like I said, I paid 214 out of pocket. And I got back my 199 register reward, so it was free. I had to pay tax, that's why I was 214 Then for transaction number two, I did the Scott toilet paper deal. If you're not familiar with it, the toilet paper is $5.00. And there's a $1.25 coupon in the Walgreens booklet, plus a $0.50 cents off coupon in the inserts that came out in the one six Smart Source. So I went ahead, used that, got the toilet paper for $3.75, and then I went ahead and, or $3.25, excuse me, and then I grabbed another pack of the gummies. I didn't roll my register reward. I did use 2,000 points, so here's my receipt right here. I used, as you see, a $0.50 cent coupon, $1.25 coupon. Two dollars in points, um, so I ended up paying three seventy six and getting back a one ninety nine register reward. So that was a great transaction. So overall today, I got these three. Now let me go through and tell you about the shaving cream. Now I can't believe I missed this deal on Sunday. So the Gillette shaving creams were on a promo: buy two get five thousand points. These ones were priced at one ninety nine. Yes, there's even some in store that are priced at. Um, 149 so my subscribers were like oh did you do the shaving cream deal and I was like no I totally missed it so I went and I went to Walgreens like I said on Monday and I was able to find six of them first transaction I did two of them so I grabbed two $1.99 each it brought the total to three dollars and ninety eight cents and then I grabbed this all made uh, deep like me it's like a BB cream. It was on clearance for $3.69 and I used that $3 off coupon that I showed you all. So it made this just $0.69. Cents. So subtotal was $4.67. With tax, the total was over $5. So as you can see, I rolled 5,000 points up here. You can see that I uh, did the All May, did the Gillette, used the All May $3 coupon, used 5,000 points. I ended up paying just $0.17 cents for two Gillette and one all May skin match bb cream and they gave me back as you can see you'll see i used 5,000 points i got back 5,000 points so it was like i basically got this stuff for free because i left with the same i even left with 20 more points than i came in with and i left with three items so i was happy about that transaction and then transaction number two i was like let me get out the store because i was in there forever i got the other four gillette shaving creams Total was seven dollars and ninety six cents. I went ahead and used five dollars in points. Remember, I told you I kept trying to do the gummy deal and it wouldn't go through. So I had three dollars on gift cards from refunds. So I used that. So I ended up only paying forty eight cents out of pocket for this transaction, and I got back. I got back ten thousand points. So I ended with twenty two thousand six hundred and fifty points. And two one ninety nine register rewards. Total cash that I had to spend was nine dollars and fifty five cents to get all of this. And again, I ended with a surplus of five thousand points and three ninety nine in register rewards. So overall, I'm happy. I'm so happy I finally was able to get some of the gummy bears. Um, if you want more details about the Scotts deal, check out my Sunday video from January sixth. And again, this deal buy two get 5,000 points. It works on the 149 and it works on the 199 um, price of the Gillette. So if you can still find some in store, the deals are good until Saturday. I'll be stopping by to see if they restocked because it's a $1 money maker. So all of these were a dollar money maker. So I basically made $3 when buying them because you pay $4 and get $5. So it was a no brainer. If you want to do any of these deals, they are valid until Saturday, January 12th. So, this video is going up on Thursday. So, you can go Friday or Saturday to catch these deals. Buy two, get 5,000 points. Spend $199, get a $199 register reward back. 
And then the Scotch paper towels are $5 and use the 125 Walgreens booklet and 50 cents manufacturer coupon. You can get a 12 pack for $3.25 and I forgot to tell you that Abata, Abata has a $1 rebate. Mine reset from Sunday so I'm going to go and uh, redeem for my rebate. It's going to make the final cost just $2.25. So if you don't have Abata, click the link in the description box, sign up, check out the tutorial, get your $1 back, okay? So, again, if you want to do these deals, you have until January 12th to go ahead and snag them. If you have any questions, please comment them down below, all right? That is pretty much it. Thank you all so much for the love and support. We really appreciate it. As always, please like, share, subscribe. Follow us on Instagram if you're not doing so already. My Instagram handle is the Crystal Sharp, and I will see you all in the next video.